More sad news for hip-hop fans. I'm sorry to report this, but Coops the Nika from 3-6 Mafia unfortunately passed away. I'm going to read to you what TMZ had to say about his unfortunate passing, and then I'll give my opinion. So TMZ writes, and I quote, Another member of 3-6 Mafia has passed away. Coops the Nika died on Thursday after suffering a stroke, according to DJ Paul. Paul announced Coops's death on social media Thursday evening but then did a quick about face saying Koopsta was still fighting and on life support. He eventually died overnight and Paul released a statement saying, quote, everyone who knew Coop knew he was very funny and the coolest guy ever. He will be missed, end quote. KK had been hospitalized since last weekend when he suffered the stroke. He was 40, the same age as Lord Infamous, the other 3-6 Mafia member who passed away in 2013. Kusta was an original member of the Memphis rap group but was not with them when they won the Oscar in 2006. He rejoined when they became the Mafia six years later. He had recently started working on a solo record according to DJ Paul. Hashtag RIP my nika. And, end quote. And yes, TMZ actually, actually included hashtag RIP my nika in their story. Can you believe that? Anyway, they're off the chain. Anyways, R.I.P. to Koopsta, you know, he unfortunately passed away at such a young age. I mean, wow, only 40 years old, you know. But I said it before, but I'm going to say it again because I want to reiterate a point that when these rappers keep dying because a, a handful of people have died in 2015. Let me see. It was Chinks Drugs, who unfortunately was murdered. Let me see. Fatal Hussein, or rather Hussein Fatal, who died in a car accident. There was Sean Price. I think he passed away in his sleep. And now Koopsta Nika. And he died from a stroke. And as crazy as this may sound, it actually is a relief to me when I first read a headline that a rapper unfortunately passed away, whether they're from the 90s or unfortunately one of the younger rappers. But basically... When I see the headline, but then I look, you know, and I read beyond the headline and I'm like, wait a second, but he wasn't shot. I don't know, man. I guess when Biggie, Pac, Big L, so many rappers being shot and dying in such a violent way on a personal level, it definitely eases my mind to see that they did not die, you know, in a violent way like so many other rappers have, unfortunately. But anyways, this is all my opinion. R.I.P. to Coops to Nika. Shout out to the 3-6 Mafia. Let me know what you think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com for more.